tropical storm watches have been issued in Guam thanks to tropical depression 16W. At least at this time, though, that area not terribly organized. You can see that here on satellite imagery as kind of coming into that circle. And uh, over the last 12 hours, losing a lot of those higher cloud tops. That's why it's going from that bright white and kind of getting faded out. But uh, JTWC still does expect this to intensify up to a tropical storm as it passes south of Guam. Could be seeing some 100 to 200 millimeters of a rainfall with those gusty conditions as well as it passes over the island. Uh, overall, though, this is not going to be anything more than your, you know, your moderate type of tropical storm. Definitely not typhoon conditions. I do know that went into a T core three out there, meaning that you know you got to prepare for that possibility of damaging winds. But the winds likely are going to be topping upwards uh, with gust about 30 to 40 miles per hour as it passes right over or just south of the island. So like I mentioned, tropical storm watches are in place as that passes by as you go ahead through Tuesday with that tail end of it as we go ahead into Wednesday and Thursday still some lingering showers behind it. I know these temperatures also are in Celsius. I, of course, understand Guam is American and empirical. I just don't feel like changing all of my graphics up for uh, the island out here. But yeah, we're going to continue to watch this storm system. I know it's just one of my quick updates. I don't have a full one here, but it's the good news is that uh, Trump Depression 16W, not terribly strong at this point.